Hey guys, you're watching Zuman and Only. My name is AJ. Welcome back to another episode of Let's Build an Island Mansion. For some reason, my uh, OBS files, the program that I use to record all my videos, has uh, reset completely. So I think I've got it set up about the same. I think I might be a little bit smaller, but a few of you guys said that uh, I was a little bit too big anyway, so maybe that would be good. Apart from that, I think everything else is set up. So if there is something a little bit different, if I sound slightly different, if something looks a little bit different, let me know in the comments, and I shall fix it for the next episode. But I think it's good. I don't know why. I was recording. I was recording fine. No problem. I stopped recording. I went to record the next uh, video on a different series. Hit record. And it went, program went, it's not responding, not working. So I closed it, tried again, didn't close. So I restarted my computer. When I restarted my computer and opened up OBS, it had deleted all of my presets for all the different set stuff that I have to do to, to get this all, you know, the, the double webcam thing for the one-up boxes. I got to re redo all that. But I think I got the Minecraft one back up and running. We'll just have to see. Do I get a sound? Yes, I got sound. Wonderful. So, we're back in the Island Mansion today. I haven't done anything. We've got these two rooms to do downstairs, but I think today I want to start on upstairs a little bit. I've already put down the uh, ceiling in here throughout the whole house, so that worked out really well. I've done a little bit of finagling as well to make sure that it was smooth all the way along because there was a couple of spots that had, like, uh, the roof poking through, so I, I changed that up just a little bit uh, and got it all worked out. But, just to remind ourselves, me and you, we've got bedroom, we've got bedroom, we've got bedroom, we've got little desk area, we've got master bedroom with walk-in wardrobe and ensuite. So there is, there's a bathroom upstairs, but it's an ensuite for the master bedroom only. The other bathroom is downstairs. I could make one of these rooms into a bit, like I could make this one into a bathroom if I wanted to, but is it really need to? The house isn't big enough to warrant having uh, three bathrooms and three bedrooms is what it would work out to be. It just doesn't make sense, does it? So, the beds. Let's bang through those first because that isn't, isn't going to be difficult if I can stop hiccuping. We're going to go with red, a red bed, a cyan bed, and an orange bed because I think those three, three colors are going to be good. That dog might have to go because he's already driving me nuts and it hasn't even been like an episode. So, I'll have a red bed in here. That's like a two by three block one. Uh, this is a smaller bedroom, so we're going to have... Oh, it's got four bedrooms, I think. We're going to have a blue one in there. Same size bed. I think that bed just works out really well uh, for the size. And we'll have an orange one. Oops, an orange one in here. Do I like how that sort of goes up against that? Maybe we can put a lamp there or something like that. I'll leave it there for the moment. And in the master bedroom, we can have a, maybe a slightly bigger bed. Mm, three blocks. No, I think I think the two blocks just working out really, really well. Uh, I do need another one, though. Apparently, it's four bedrooms up here. I miscounted. So let's have blue. We'll have a nice dark blue for the master one. Yeah, that works out well. Nice amount of space to be able to get around to the bathroom, etc. And so on. So... What else do we have in bedrooms? We need to get some dresses. So let's get... Uh, I want a couple of different types of wood. I think I want oak for a lighter one. So we'll have some oak stuff. I want uh, dark oak as well. Because dark oak... I, I love like how they look in the dark oak. And I think we'll mix like both of those together. All the bedrooms are going to be very similar in look. Um, just because it makes things a lot easier. Oh, let's have this maybe two or three blocks high like that you know what I'm gonna change this cyan one to a pink one and this can be a girls room uh, I haven't got any pink wool because obviously that's been changed to a row texture so we'll have that this could be like a little girl a, a little princess's room uh, so we want like a little shelf for shoes and dresses and stuff like that uh, I think a lighting we should probably do lighting as well first uh beacons let's have a pink light in here because it just makes sense doesn't it let's have a pink and silver one uh, how do we want to do this like that or do we have a lamp there isn't really like a pink lamp is there no we're gonna have to go with this maybe that's that's as centered as as centered as i can get for that one uh this one little orange room you know what what if we match the lights to the bedrooms i think that could be pretty cool so we need a blue one we need an orange one and a red one 
I think it was, wasn't it? This is the orange one. Yeah, no, that look, that's pretty cool. That's pretty good. That one and, oops, and that one. We'll have like a double light in here because it's a little bit bigger. The bathroom and the walk-in wardrobe will worry about lighting in a moment. And then the red one is down here. Like that. Yeah! No, that's cool. That's really, really cool. Uh, so what else would a little girl have in her bedroom? We need a, a bedside table. Maybe a bookshelf we'll use for that because they could uh, store some magazines in there. Things like that. Uh... A desk would be a good one as well, like a little desk. If we use a dark oak desk, just so it stands out against, just so it stands out against the uh, wardrobe next to it. Yeah, that works out well. Just homework, things like that, and uh, posters, paintings. So we'll have some paintings around. Yes, no, yes. That's a nice one. And yeah, that that's nice. That's good. We haven't really got too much room for a bed in here, uh, for, uh, for a, a rug, sorry. Uh, but I wonder if we could do something. Maybe if it was just a couple of white bits of wool. Carpet. We haven't got any sort of girly colors because I changed the pink and purple wool to the roads because you don't really use them in city building that much. That looks okay, though. I like the gray. That works out really well for that little bedroom. Uh, for this one, this is a bit of a, a boy's bedroom. So uh, let's put a TV on the wall. I'm not saying that girls don't like watching TV. We've just got the space to have a TV in here. I guess a little bit too big. How are we going to do this? You can only really do sort of big TVs in Minecraft, can't you? Um, stairs. And slabs. Yeah, it's impossible to do like a small TV, isn't it? We'll put this one on a, on a stand like this. And I think I want like a place for some games to go. So if we do that and then we get a slab to go on top. Like, oh, this one could work out really well. It's like, oh, no, slab. It looks a little bit like an Xbox One. Do you know what I mean? With the line down it and the CD tray. That works out pretty good. Yeah, no, I like that. You can have his Xbox, Xbox One on there. Uh, we can put a lamp in here. A nice uh, black and red lamp. We can have one on that side. And on this side, I think I want a table. So we're going to go with a fence and uh, carpet design. I think we're going to go with brown carpet, though. Or maybe black carpet. Oh, I don't have black carpet, do I? Uh, we'll use dark grey carpet, then. Just so it goes with the um, stand a little better. Like that. Put your drink on the side there. Alarm clock. Things like that. For the rug... Uh, we want to have carpet, red, and I think red and grey would go really well. It'll blend in with the room. And I think we're going to do the same, a similar sort of carpet design to the girls' bedroom, but just one block longer because we have that little bit of room. He doesn't have a wardrobe, though. Unless I can get a wardrobe in there. Uh, yeah, should be able to. Let's have this one three blocks tall. Uh and then the slab to finish up the top. That looks good. No, I'm happy with that. Uh, paintings again. Some posters in the bedroom I think would work out well. So we'll have... I want a two, a two tall one. What? Yeah, like that. That's good. That could be like something from a game. And one above the door. That's about all the room that we really have. Maybe a single one like that. Beautiful. Okay, two bedrooms done out of four. Next one, we have the orange one. Now, this one, we've got this sort of weird bit of wall here, which I don't think that we're going to be able to take advantage of. So, I'm going to fill that in. And um, what can we have in here? We've got this weird step thing, which I really wish that we could take advantage of, but I don't really know how. I think it's just a good one to, I don't know, escape out of the night when your, your parents don't want you to see. You get out of the window, get out, sit on the roof, watch the fireworks. I know a lot of people do that. Climb out onto the roof to watch the fireworks. Uh, we don't have an awful lot of room. I'll tell you what we're going to do in here. Instead of using the stairs and slabs for it, we're going to use chests for this uh, wardrobe. I'm going to put three chests on top of each other. It's a little bit different. It stands out to the other rooms. Just a different way of doing things. And I'm going to put a plant... No, I'm going to use plants in the master... Ooh, I nearly fell off my chair then. Whoa, I tried to just... <laughs> Elevate myself a little bit and nearly kill myself. Um, do I have... What lamps do we have? We don't have any orange lamps. The brown one could work out quite well. I don't like the gold, but the brown sort of works quite well with the orange. 
No, let's go for that, but let's have it there instead. No, I don't like that. No, I think I like it in the corner. Or there. Nope, I like it in the corner. We'll have it in the corner there. Uh, again, we want a bedside table. I'm going to go with the three bookshelves, though, for this one. I'm going to have a bookshelf here, here, and here. Like that. And then maybe a bedside lamp. So we can put this one. These are actually really cool. Um, if you put them on the ground, they sort of sit on the ground. But if you put them on the wall, they have a little connection part. So, like, it'll connect to it. And if you put it on the roof, it'll actually hang down with a little chain. So, there's, like, three different ones that you can have. Really cool. Very, um, I'm going to put diagonally as well. Uh, very universal. You can use it for a lot of different things, can't you? And uh, I think we're going to go with another carpet design. Here we're going to go with white and light grey. Uh, or, or orange and light grey. No, orange and white wool. Uh, oops, carpet. I wish I could use the chairs and stuff like that, but we just don't have the room. The rooms aren't big enough. They're like nice, small. But it's very much like my house. My house, I've got a lot of rooms. I think I've got 26 rooms in my house. But the rooms are small and uh, sort of like this. Maybe not this small, but they are. They're sort of smaller, so they sort of fit in a little bit more. Okay, that's good. And in the master bedroom, I do want plants in here. Now, have I used the Eye of Ender style plant in this house? Let's have a look. Fly all the way over here. We're pretty much at the end of this series as well. There's only a few sort of little uh, rooms to do. There's some things that I want to do outside. Someone said like adding a... Um, oh, no, we used lamps in here, didn't we? Someone said using a um, a bridge to connect the island with the um, uh, tower island. That would be nice. And I think I want to make this island a little bit bigger as well. Uh, I think it looks a little bit small for the size of the tower, that we've, the, the lighthouse that we've got on it. So making it a little bit more rocky would be good. And adding some leaves and dressing that island up definitely needs to be done. But... There's definitely progression, and we, we are getting towards a completed stage. So if you do have an idea in the comments section uh, for another series, if it be another building series uh, or, or whatever, let me know. I do have one planned as well, so if you guys do mention that one, I, it's already being done. I'm not going to say what it is, uh, but it is already being done. Um, if you do mention that one, I'm going to have two lamps in here because we've got the room for it. Uh, but if you have any a sort of other idea, it doesn't have to be on this world. In fact, I would... I would rather it not be on this world because the other series that I have for this, uh, or the other series that I have lined up, um, is for this world. Portal. That's the one. Um, is for this world, so I don't want to have too many series going on, on on this world. I like to have two, maybe three, but no more than that on the same world at one time. Uh, but if you guys have an idea, then let me know. I'm always always interested uh, for for uh, new series ideas. Especially from you guys, because I know that you guys want them if you suggest them. Let's have a coving around this one. This room's big enough to have a little white edging that goes around it. Around the corner here. Around the edge. And just nipping behind the beacons. That looks so cool. Okay, I want a little bedside table beside each one. We're going to go with a fence one. I do like colour coding the rooms it looks so good I, i'm not gonna go with blue tabletop so i'm gonna go with gray um oops but yeah i i do I, i've never done sort of a color coded rooms before it work it's working really really well though uh carpets we also want blue carpets for in here i think i'm gonna go with blue and gray since i've sort of done some gray in here already and i like doing this sort of checker design for the carpets as well through the room again there's nothing that i can do with this area it's a half a slab up which means we can't place anything on it uh, that will connect. Uh, so it's sort of a little bit of wasted space, but I don't know. Maybe you guys could be smart enough. I can't delete them because obviously it's the ceiling to the floor below as well. We knew that we would come across sort of a sort of problem like this as we went, but it doesn't really matter. Let's have a table there to take up that room. Uh, as far as the dresser goes, we've got a walk-in wardrobe for this one. And I think I'm going to go with chests for in here at that part. But that... Ooh. Uh, forgot to do the ceiling in here. There we go. Uh, so we've got the the chests in here. I might as well do them up there. Oh no, it will have a uh, slab, I think, above there. And then I'm going to get carpets, brown carpets, and string for the bottom layer. And I'm going to have shelves in here, just two blocks wide, I think. 
yeah, have them like that. I know they're touching the chests, but they're still accessible. And you can have some shoes, uh, towels, things like that uh, in that. So it's like a little walk-in wardrobe section. And then we've got the walk-in uh, or the ensuite bathroom in here. I still don't think I like that. It's not big enough. If you're going to do an, ink, uh, uh, an, uh, an alcove, it needs to be at least two blocks. The one block never seems to work. Now, we don't have an awful lot of room in here for the ensuite. It's a three by three area. Uh, we can fit the toilet in here and a sink. And I think that's pretty much an, all you can fit. Or a sink and toilet like that. Or a toilet and sink like that. I think I like that design the best okay then so anvil what was that oh it's a big plane i don't think i've flown that one yet i might fly that one at the end of the episode uh and i haven't i definitely haven't flown that one before i don't know what it looks like so we'll have anvil we've all seen this before stairs i've even done it on this series but i do like it um quartz uh trap door it's, it's just the design that I always use and trip. Why hook? Uh, that one, that one, that one, that one. And then for the sink, we just want a normal sink. So I think I'm just going to use a cauldron for in here. Cauldron, mirror, because it just looks so awesome. Yes, and a fluorescent. Covered fluorescent to go above the... Uh, uh, window because we don't really have enough room unless I put a beacon at the top there beacon uh, I do like the fluorescent tubes around the windows it just looks really cool yeah I might change this roof this part or this area to quartz as well have a little bit of a white roof in here yeah it just stands out that little bit doesn't it I like that okay uh, wonderful I could put the sink can I put that on the side? No, the window takes it up. I can't put a tap on it. It doesn't really matter that much. Item frame. Item frame. And white carpet. Or snow block. Let's go in here. As a little cupboard. And I think that's good. Toilet and uh, A toilet and sink is standard for an ensuite. You don't usually... Is my hat straight? You don't usually have a... Um, uh, a sink or a, a shower or a bath in an ensuite. Some do, some do, uh, but a lot of them don't. A lot of them are just sort of toilet for if you need the toilet in the middle of the night. That's sort of what they're there for. But there we go. There's four bedrooms completed. How are we doing for time? We're pretty much really out of time. Um, let's fly this plane then. We can do the hallway and stuff next episode. I want to see what this is like. I don't know how big it is. It looks like a big one. Let's get a bit of a flat space maybe we can do a flyby over the island with it depending on how fast it's sometimes if it's too fast the low the world just can't load fast enough uh, but we'll see let's uh, i don't even know what way it faces usually they face to the left oh it's a c1 am i going to be able to take off from the ground then next seat um t oh that's not t f sorry I couldn't see it. The minimap was over it. That's a machine gun one. 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 And then this one. What about that seat? I want that seat. Can I get that seat? I can't start it. Maybe this is why I've never flown it before. Because I can't. Let's put it in the water. Uh-huh. Aha! Now I'm in. It was this seat. Let's back out. Uh, no, not that one. That one. It's like a proper old-style war one. And... We're off. Yeah! <laughs> oh, it's so cool! Okay, don't unload the world. Don't unload the world. We're going to have to dip down a little bit so the world doesn't unload. Check that out. And digga, 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 digga. What if we turn the shaders on? I'm not going to shoot. I'm not going to shoot the guns. I could, but a lot of the guns blow up blocks, and I don't really want to wreck the place. 
If you use a machine gun, some some machine guns break them up, but all bombs do. And I don't know what weapon we've got selected as the uh, pilot. Oh, we're going to crash. Pull up a little bit. That's so cool. The tractor and the barn. Check that out. Oh, that's so cool. Around the, uh, around the lighthouse. Steady. Steady. Yeah. All right, let's bring her in for a land. And let's come all the way around. We'll land sort of in front of that boat, I think. We've got to try and skim the top of that boat. How far are we? We should be good to turn around now. I love this. It's something that I could just do if I, like, in between episodes and if I get bored when I'm not recording. I just come on here and I just fly planes and look at the world. It's really cool to do. Okay, we need to get... Oh, no, I got out. I, uh, I hit shift and got out. I don't think it's going to blow up anything when it hits the ground. <laughs> Blows up everything. Hey, that's pretty good. It landed itself. Is it going to stop, though? It might. I, I can't. I can't go any faster than what I'm going. And I'm not catching up with it. Oh, I'm starting to catch up with it. Yeah, yeah, yeah it's stopping. It's stopping. There we go. Wonderful. Okay, I just need to destroy it now. So we didn't. We didn't. We didn't crack the landing. But we are out of time for this episode. If you guys enjoyed it, hit that like button. If you haven't already, then feel free to subscribe. We shall see you in the next episode. Bye.